Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. Oh. <laughs> so we're starting this vlog from the car, as you can see. And we thought we would film today, kind of do like a day in our lives kind of vlog. We're both off work today, so. And we love I mean, our little adventures. Yeah, so we are off to Brighton for the day. I got my sunglasses on, but as soon as you turned the camera on to film, it then went really dark. No. <laughs> it was really sunny this morning, but it keeps kind of peeping through and then going. So uh, hopefully in Brighton it's, it's uh, sunny and we can go on the pier and we actually want to do the mini golf. Oh yeah. Um, at Brighton Marina called Globals. It's kind of a glow in the dark. I think it has a Jurassic theme and a Tropicana theme thing. And guess which one I wanted to do. <laughs> Dinosaur! We're not gonna make it! <laughs> if you get that reference, pop it down in the comments. <laughs> and we've been listening to Disney hits on Spotify. It's like someone's playlist. Um, and we've just been getting really excited for Disney World, haven't we? Yeah, we're actually talking about how we're gonna vlog it. So, yeah? Very interesting. And I, I'm on the countdown and when we film this, it will be less when this goes up, but when we filmed it, we have 60 days. So it's not long, it is getting close. <laughs> um, and then in 30 days time, we'll be able to book our fast passes. It's getting close. And I've also started to receive some clothing items that oh, yeah. I purchased to do with Disney that uh, I was able to get because of the links that you supplied in our video. Yeah. So, so Thanks to all them and Martin, we're doing a haul soon. <laughs> yeah. A Disney haul. So yeah. But for now we are on our way to Brighton. So uh, let the road trip commence. He was crossing a roof line and now he's dear. And so I'm sure. I wonder why I didn't see it there before. shopping and stuff but Brighton Marina is just a bit down from the pier you got a friend in me you got a friend in me when the nights got cold who stole you fire from down below just look at that yo oh so I love last so the sun you're welcome Gonna go this After one. Martin's freaking out because there's too many spaces. Right on the Doesn't know what one to pick. Minutes, then turn right. Look, yeah, I hope go. it's not busy then. Famous last words. Yeah, I think we're on the very top level. <laughs> <laughs> well, I was like, when no one's parking yeah. here, so we might as well. Right, let's get out into this sunshine. So I'm so happy it started getting hot in um, in England again. This winter's been long, hasn't it? It has. It has. So, hopefully this sunshine stays. <laughs> Not sure how much you're gonna see because it is glow in the dark. Ready? Yeah. Round one. Glow in the dark Two, paper. Oh, I'm winning, let's go now. <laughs> <laughs> what happened there? Wait, that was a, that was a practice. Didn't make it up the hill. <laughs> oh, darling. 
<laughs> so I'll count that as one shot. Oh, totally. <laughs> oh you're gonna hit mine! Oh, how are you gonna take how are you gonna take that? <laughs> It's very cool in here, isn't it? Look at that. <laughs> Yay, three. Four, my uncle. This one's four. tricky. Four. Four. Is that four? Four, yeah. Four? Is that an iguana, Don? <laughs> Might be actually. Is it? What did you get two? I got two. I got four. Four of three. <laughs> Your teeth are like really shiny. <laughs> Oh, I don't know if you can see this, but it's an outline of a so you can't get it into the... of a foot, a claw. Oh, all in one! Yes, two, two. <laughs> oh, amazing. What's the fascination between Jurassic like period and golf? It happens a lot everywhere. Dinosaurs love golf. All the artwork in here is like really impressive, though, isn't it? On the walls. It's crazy. Okay, so you got a hole in one in that one. I unfortunately had to write down six because I couldn't get it in in six shots, and they've got a six shot rule. I might put it back now. <laughs> this, this is a friendly dinosaur. You've got to get it through the hole. Oh, you did it! Has it got in? It's nearly there. It's going. It's going. <laughs> oh, hey there. You playing golf? That's a pterodactyl. They usually look quite mean looking, but this one looks quite tame. Right, so this one, you've got to get it in that hole that's up a ramp, and then you've got to get it over here. You didn't see anything, okay? Oh, nothing happens. Oh, there's nothing oh, in there. So where are we meant to so do? What happens? Oh, are you meant to hit it up here so it goes over oh, there? Oh, that is the hole. Is that the hole? So I was wrong about that. That's the actual hole for this one, and then this is a separate so hole. Moved on, we created a bit of a gap, a bit of a backlog. This one's a bit different. I so think you've you're got meant to, to like hit it once and then see what points it. And then it's got numbers here. You want to try and get one then, you want to try and get the lowest one. We're at the T-Rex. Yeah. Gotta go from there over to the volcano. Oh, they're having a Barney look. They're having a fight. A little quibble. I think I'm losing, so I'm just enjoying the scenery. This one's a bit scary. He's trying to put you off, like at the beginning, staring right at you. What do I need? Oh, that you can put it in there if you want it to be fancy. Oh, so it does like a loop. Yeah. <laughs> He's watching you. You do it. You go first. Okay, so you've got to you got to spin this, and then whatever it lands on, you do. Take any opponent's score for this hole. So if you. But you, do... you want to wait till you know. <laughs> or, or do you have to do it before? So you have to like risk it. Let's do that. No, okay. No, because now you can just sabotage yourself. No. Oh, yeah, I mean, you okay. Have to wait after, and see. After. Yeah. <laughs> Attempt your first shot, shot with, with your, your eyes shut. <laughs> Helena is golfing now with her eyes closed. Ready? Yeah, eyes shut. You did quite well, actually, yeah. So we ended up both getting it in two, so. It doesn't matter if I steal your score. You can have my score. <laughs> it's the last one. It's the last one? Yeah. Number 12. Okay. It's last a one shot hole. If you miss the hole, you score a six. Do not try to find your ball. It disappears. Ooh! <laughs> okay. One shot. Do oh, not miss your chance this. to blow. This opportunity comes once in a lifetime. <laughs> You got six. six. That's hard, that. He's laughing at you, look. <laughs> okay, come on. <laughs> I 
didn't even you didn't even just well, that doesn't count because my no, balls it does, come back. It no, does. My balls come that back. counts. That no, counts. No, that counts. Come on, you can't even. Why are they going? I feel like you should get 12 points for that. No. <laughs> okay, Martin. 49. What do you think? The so par I, was 26. I got 49. 42. I'm a winner. Seven points in it. I was scared of the dinosaurs. I don't know why, but I said we'd keep it. <laughs> Pulled it back. I started. To I don't know where everything fell apart. I, th I, I, I think. <laughs> Maybe you got too cocky. I think Chessington World of Adventure when we were on Tomb Blaster. That's when everything <laughs> turned round. <laughs> I started winning challenges for once. <laughs> Buzz Lightyear, Tomb Blaster. That's really good. Glow fun. balls. If yeah. you're around um, Brighton Marina, definitely give that a go. And it's really quick. It's like how long is that? We were about 45 minutes. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. Um, Speaking of Chessington uh, World of Adventure, there's oh, something that cropped up there that I've just noticed in the background again. <laughs> this exact same thing. In a minute she'll go, Whee! <laughs> That's creepy. <laughs> They're everywhere. Should we ever go to have a little look at Brighton Marina? Yeah. Oh look, the sun's out. We parked in the... Uh, marina car park and it's free for four hours so Let's go explore well. yeah have a look around we were just saying though around here looks when we used to work on cruise ships yeah when you used to get off in port this is what they all used to look like sort of uh diamond shops clothes shops restaurants just dotted around palm trees, palm trees. <laughs> it's pretty, isn't it? it's beautiful isn't it especially because the sun's shining look at this it's gorgeous so we have picked Franco Manca. Yeah. I don't know if I said that right. <laughs> I agree with that statement. Though. Make pizza, not war. <laughs> Shooting out pizza. <laughs> and we turn to the left. Amazing view. We've been once before, we've been to Franco Manca. Yeah, in London. Yeah, this lovely. is slightly different. <laughs> Sourdough pizza. We've got organic lemonade. And it's very um, yellow. Yeah. I like it. It's like yeah. it would be very lovely. Taste, taste test. Taste test. Mm, nice. <laughs> and then we got Tastes a little, like actual lemons. A little side salad as well there. To share. I'm trying to be healthy. <laughs> to be healthy with, this, with the pizza. <laughs> this pizza is so big that it won't even fit in the camera. <gasps> so good. The size of it. So what's yours? Tomato, mozzarella and mozzarella, mozzarella and basil. Yeah. It's because I was combining Classic. basil and mozzarella. And then mine is the old spot ham, mozzarella, buffalo ricotta and wild mushrooms. Oh yeah. How full are you on a scale of one to ten? <laughs> <laughs> Helena's been singing this song, I'm full as an egg. So I thought you were going to say on a scale of like... One to egg. One to egg. <laughs> I recently heard the phrase, I'm full as an egg. And now I use it all the time. But has anyone else heard of that phrase before? My favourite. <laughs> what was the one? As full as a wardrobe full of goats. Coats. Oh, coats. I thought you said goats. That's no. why I, You never queried me. <laughs> I, was, I was saying, what do you mean goats? <laughs> <laughs> um, so that was that was a, such a nice lunch. Um, so back in the car, and we're going to drive over to the pier, have a little mooch around, yeah. maybe get an ice cream on the pier. You want to go on the waltz? I don't do want to go on the waltz, although not right now. <laughs> I'm going to have to wait a little bit. <laughs> it's such a lovely day. Let's go. Nightmare parking. <laughs> we 
found somewhere in the end, just right, right by the seafront, but we can only spend about two hours. Yeah, so it's less than planned, but we're still going to have a good time. An ice cream and the boosters, <laughs> and I'm happy. Yeah. I did have an experience driving around the centre of Brighton, <laughs> around the lanes. Stressful. <laughs> But we're here now. Don't bring your car into the centre of Brighton. Lesson no. learned. We should have maybe just stayed where we were and then just of walked along, to be honest. Oh yeah, we just noticed there's Elvis. <laughs> pointing out, well he's trying to point, I think he's lost his fingers. <laughs> okay. Pointing out fish and chips. Oh. Uh -huh. um, but I was going to say, so right at the end of the pier, you see this really tall thing? And this is, I would not go on this if you paid me a million pounds. It just, watch it, it's gonna go around now. So it just starts swinging. Look how high it is. I'll I'd zoom go on in. I'd it if you paid me a million pounds. Oh, I, I couldn't. <laughs> Look at it, they're gonna go around. There's people in that. And all you can see is the sea. <laughs> oh, it just makes me feel ill looking at it. Like over your head. I feel like the seagulls over here. <laughs> yeah. Don't eat your fish and chips Thanks. when you're on here. Oh. I will give you a wealth of wisdom. One of my favourite films is Big with Tom Hanks, and this just reminds me of at the beginning when he wishes that he could be an adult. <laughs> the claw <laughs> with slots. <laughs> I got a fright, not by this guy, but by this guy in the corner. <laughs> How did? Oh yeah, Disneyland Paris, the shooting yeah. range where I was gypped. I hit those targets. <laughs> <laughs> so as you come along the Brighton Pier, as you saw, we went through the big arcade there. And there's just loads of stuff in there, isn't there? Yeah. There's loads of those, like two P and ten P slot machine things, and then also quite a few games. We went on the dance You've got one last time. A lot of money. Yeah, <laughs> the cash machines do charge you one pound ninety-five. So come with the cash already. Hmm. Does this remind you of anything? Thomas the tank engine, but Joy Joy the jet plane. <laughs> <laughs> Got the horror hotel there. The man to check you in, Frankenstein. So I showed this from right the way up there, but here it is. Devastated. Well, there's no line for it, and there's nobody here. <laughs> Sorry! So it looks like a lot of the stuff today isn't on, unfortunately. But this is the Crazy Mouse coaster. They got another coaster over there, haven't they? Turbo, I don't know if that was here last time we came. There's a log flume as well, but... That's not operating. Mm. Thanks. Had to be done. I'm scared of the seagulls. Can we hide? <laughs> They're gonna get me. It's <laughs> chill life. <laughs> chilling in your deck chair. Does this make you happy after the waltzer incident? Close a monster. <laughs> How can you do this to me? <laughs> there were some other eyes you could have gone on. Not only the haunted house. <laughs> now one of the waltzers. It's a waltzer or nothing for me. <laughs> Look who we got up there. 
or versions of them. The goof, have you seen the goof? He looks like he's on some sort of like <laughs> stag do or something. Yeah. Drinking his vodka for a straw. <laughs> So if you're interested in knowing like how you can pay to get on all the rides, there's a few options. You can pay for them individually by topping up with a pay card. Uh, you can pay £12 for those between 0.9 metres and 1.2 metres at certain rides. But then £22.50 gets you on everything. All rides all day. But before you buy it, check that they're all open. Yeah, because some, some of the weekdays are required. Yeah, some of the rides know. are off today. But if there's enough rides that you really want to go on, there's quite a few of you, it's probably best to get the £22.50. Yeah. Individually, it's about £4. I think most are about £4.50. Yeah. Yeah, £4.50 to go on the uh, Horror Hotel. So, yeah. Um, Thank you for watching. Let's go check one more time. Make sure that they're definitely closed. <laughs> it's a ghost ride. Still a no. <laughs> Yeah, so 4 50 for that, but some of the rides actually go up. So like £7 for the, the really spinny one. Oh my gosh, look at that. Hey, I've grown a lot since I No, I can barely watch it. I'm watching you, I'm watching you. Look at that camera. Right, so what did I do? When I got my ice cream, I was so scared and so tentative about walking along this pier and sitting down with my ice cream. I was scared that a seagull was going to come and steal it from me. And you said, oh no, they don't attack for ice creams. But we just saw a poor lady walking along with her ice cream. And then from behind, this from behind though, seagull like... swoops down and knocks it out of her hand. And then they all just come in. That was really harsh as well because it was from behind. So, Oh, be careful. She didn't even have time to like, I think it was like her first um, bite of it. She was like, <laughs> Just don't be careful. Those seagulls. Oh. <laughs> it's funny because like the first seagull like got it and then about 10 came from nowhere. Yeah. Was, like, like a pack of wolves. Let's <laughs> all get the ice cream. They eat oh, anything. Oh, bless her. I know, she saw the funny side though. She was laughing. But then like dived out the way because then like 15 seagulls came along. Well, at least you <laughs> so we're actually going to head off in a moment but we just wanted to come over here and show this on the camera because we saw it last time we were here and we were like whoa it's like uh, Indian and Chinese architecture in the middle of Brighton and this was apparently King George IV's pleasure palace <laughs> and it, that's what's cool <laughs> that. <laughs> that's what it says on the sign over there I didn't research it before I came I just read the sign over there <laughs> so this is it the royal pavilion yeah We'll have to go inside. One day. One point, yeah. She's Martin's scared of this guy. He's just combing the street. Because no one else is here. <laughs> hey guys, so we're back home. Martin had already started importing the footage and I was like, we haven't said bye. <laughs> <laughs> too eager. Uh, so we got back. I'm already in. My comfies. <laughs> Got all the dwarfs on them. <laughs> Does anyone else do that? Like, as soon as they get in the door, it's like, how did I wear these jeans all day? Because they're so uncomfortable and I'm like, I have to put on my comfies. But yeah, we had such a good day in Brighton. Um, the sun is still shining. It's still such a nice day. Yeah, we really enjoyed the globals, the mini golf, and um, sitting around Brighton Marina. That was really nice. And yeah, it was lovely to, to go on the pier for a couple of hours even though the waltzer wasn't working, but it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> that means you I'm over it. <laughs> and you could get that. You could get that pass where you can go on all the rides all day. Just, just get it and just go on the waltzer <laughs> all day. Oh, I think how sick you'd be. <laughs> so yeah, we're just gonna relax for the rest of the evening. I'm actually gonna make myself a cup of tea and then I'm gonna reply to all your comments on our Disneyland Paris um, favorite ride video that's just gone live today. We love replying to comments, it's like one of our favourite things to do. So thanks so much for everyone that comments, like it really means, it means a lot to us. Anyway, so on that note, we will leave you and we will see you next Monday for a brand new vlog. So thanks so much for watching guys, and we will see you then. Bye! Bye! Watch out for seagulls.